already. What's good, folks? It is K Spade the Prospect, YouTube's best kept secret, the leader of the Wolf Pack. I'm back on NBA 2K17, but I'm not on Pro Am because we at the park. By we, I mean TMM. Of course, I got a couple of my made men, brothers out here with me. Every once in a while, I promise you guys, I will start going to the park. Matter of fact, one of the members of the Wolfpack came through and issued a challenge to state. I really want you to upload two games a day. Now, I don't know if he mean two separate videos or two games in one video. So, I'm going to ask you guys, which one do you prefer? These games are kind of short. Like, I could give you, if you want like a five-minute vid, I'm, I'm pretty sure I probably could drop that daily. Because what I'm going to start doing is going to the park probably once a week, maybe. And just capture a bunch of gameplays and bring you guys the best ones. Now let me let me kind of talk on something before I go any further. If I'm gonna record 10, 15 games, and I'm a I'm gonna bring you the best ones, some of these games you're not gonna see. So there's no need to come to my comment section and say, hey, I played in a game against you and you only scored two points. Why didn't you upload that? Because I'm probably not gonna upload a two-point game. I just don't know who the hell would want to see that. I will upload some losses. But they're going to have to be good games. Like, I don't mind showing a loss. I show losses all the time. But I want to show good games. All right? Let me just go ahead and get that out there. But anyway, in this particular round, man, I'm out here with my point four with my Barley the Rasta from South Florida. I got the PG Chris Styles out here. Shout out to the homie I Styles. And I got Philly. Well, Philly did something a little different. Philly came out here with this sharpshooter. At one point, I didn't even know Philly had a sharpshooter. I was so shocked to hear this because... Philly had been kicking it with the crew, I want to say for months before he even... You set me up for sure. Play. I don't know if y'all can hear Philly right there. Philly was tight, but he didn't even mention having this player. I didn't even know he had that player. So we was like, damn, hold up, Philly, you got a shark? So this particular day, like I said, man, we don't take part entirely too serious. We're not one of those guys to feel like, you know, you, you got to have a big, you got like, whoever want to run, we just go. I don't care. We'll go to the park with three PGs. We feel like if we play smart, we still going to get dubbed. So anyway, I'm going to show you guys this gameplay right here. I was kind of messing with my moves. So you're going to see some of my stuff. I've been, I've been trying to get nice, y'all. I'm working on it. I'm getting there. One thing I need to do is get back in my no. career. Oh, oh, look at the spin. Look at the spin. Oh, let's go. I like that shot on the move. My sharp cannot make those shots, so you better believe. When I'm using mob, you'll see me utilize a lot of this shot off. Dribble is just moving shots in general. You'll see a lot of that in my gameplay. I've got to get back in my career and finish uh, my Hall of Fame uh, ankle breaker. I got to get that. Now, I know I ain't that nice with the dribbles, but shit, you ain't really got to be. I see guys come down, and all they do is flick the right stick back to get that kind of Whatever you want to call that one animation. And it be making dudes fall. That ain't even no dribble mode in me, bro. That's, you don't get credit for doing that and making somebody fall. It's all a dice roll. It's just animations anyway. I wish it was more catered to your setup. Like, if you go through and just do something ill, you should drop somebody. You shouldn't be able to just come down and flick your right stick back and drop somebody. But that's neither here nor there. I promise y'all this video ain't supposed to be about me coming out here saying what I would fix. I'm going to just show y'all that your boy was out here getting European. I'm spinning. I'm Euroing. I think that might be my second Euro of the game, right? I got the Euro thing popping out here. We got a pretty comfortable lead on this team. And it's it's tough to, to stay on it because you want this mode right here screams to you. Have fun. Try new dribble moves. Throw crazy passes. Try alley-oops out of alley-oops. Like this mode just tells you to try stupid stuff. That's why I don't really get upset if we take a loss. Uh, you know, whatever. It, it ain't even that serious to me. 18-15 is your score. Right there, I wanted to do something special. I ain't had nothing special. You just pass it out. You let Styles bang down the big time jumper. The the best taunt in the game is to wave. Now last year you had to buy this. And I remember me and LaParis would run park last year. He kept saying, Spade, what level do I have to get to to get the wave? All I want to do is wave. And the wave. A uh, taunt, a celebration, whatever you want to call it, is free this year, so I probably won't never buy no taunts. That's the most disrespectful thing you can do. Walk up to a cat that you just dragged out here, get in his face and give him that happy ass Mr. Rogers neighborhood wave with you just putting, yeah, that, that's, that's what I like. Anyway, game two of today's video, man, as you guys can see, we're playing guys with park cards, park badges, and... I don't know. You can't look at these guys and determine whether or not they're good players. The first game in this round, we played some guys, some shirtless, like, superstar legend dudes, and, and we scrubbed them up. I didn't even bring you that gameplay because it wasn't even close. 
Like, we scrubbed them guys up. Something like 21-8. I didn't even think y'all wanted to see that. But you, you can't look at these guys and tell if they're good. You can look at them and tell if they play a lot, but that don't necessarily tell you their skill level. So I guess when I see people with... Hold up, you about to get that move. Oh, no, nah, I lied, I lied. I'm going to pass it off. I got this going to the post move, and I come out of it and spin. Hold on, hold on. Bang. What? I like that shot off the dribble coming out of the post. You guys will see me do that a lot since I cannot figure out how to do the Ricky Bobby in this game. That might have to be my new move. I'm going to have to come up with a cold-ass name for it. Anyway. I try to assume when I see somebody with park badges, that means they're pretty good. I don't even know what the park badges are. I don't even know what you have to do to get them. I just know I don't have any. So when I see people that's got a few, like four or five or six, I'll be like, oh, they must be, you know, maybe they, maybe they okay. So anyway, enough of that chit chat. As you can see, we're actually down in this game early. We was kind of giving Philly a hard time. Philly is, is a, a center by nature. He plays the big position for our, oh, here go the move. That's my move, bro. I don't know if that move can be stopped. You're going to see that move a lot. Anyway, Philly plays the big for our crew. And old habits die slow, man. Like, this dude, he's a big in his mentality. So he kept doing things like on the play where he told Styles that Styles set him up. He thought Styles was going up for a shot. And he was just chasing to get. Oh, look at the spinning Rooney. He's spinning. He winning. He got my man Moon walking with his hands up over there. Come on, bro. Stay in the play. But he thought, just in case Styles missed, I'm going to attack the rack for the for the rebound. And then Styles threw it back to him. And, of course, he was probably thinking put back. He ended up throwing up some crazy mess and told Styles, like, man, you set me up like crazy. So we really had a good time out here. If you got, and I asked you in the last video, hey, if y'all liking this shit, let me know. And a lot of y'all came through like Spade. Upload more of these. So when you start seeing a lot of these on my channel, I don't want y'all to be like, Spade, what's up with all this park stuff? You trying to change up on us? Hey, I'm just trying to get the people what they want. Y'all say y'all liking it. I like it. You know, in spurs. I, I never, never say never, Spade. Hold up. Never say never. I can't really see me being that guy that's like, ooh, I can't wait to get home and get on the park. But like I said, one day a week, I can really see me coming through here, running off 10, 15 games, recording those, and being done with the park for the week. I, I really can. Like, every once in a while, the park is a good change of pace. It's fun. It's cartoons i like cartoons too everything ain't got to be a real life doc anyway 9 10 is your score folks i'm gonna see can i get my matchup to drop i'm being guarded by a post score now first of all he's short this is the new wave i see a lot of people making like post scoring small forwards i guess that's the thing i don't know but i'm gonna try my best to drop this guy before we get out of this game i'm gonna try to get the dub first but whether i get the dub or not we're gonna try to drop this guy so this is side note like that ain't even the main mission that's a side mission. I'm in the corner, wide open, rainmaker boy. Iris Spring Green on my shot meter. I don't care what my player is, I can shoot that three ball. Styles, next time, give me that steal. Get me that steal. I might need to start bringing you guys to chat. Harry, boy, the hell is wrong with you? You better get a tall post score, bro, if you want to go to the rack. You know, mob patrolling this paint. I might have to start bringing you guys to actual chat. You can hear stuff in the background, I know you can, because I forgot I still had my settings like that from my live stream. But I'm going to have to let you hear the banter and the trash talk in the party. All we do is pick at each other for missing shots. And, I mean, we, we just be goofing. We just be cooling. I'm in the paint watching the passing lane. Come up with the steal. Look at this right here. Come back here. Come back here. Let me see. Can I drop this guy? Oh, I lied. I lied. I lied. I thought I was going to drop him. I'm trying to get me some moves, y'all. What I do is I watch Styles. Styles is a funny guy. Styles really got some nice... Uh, like one-on-one -on -one stuff like his game is nice for that and I asked him one day I said Styles why don't you make like tutorial videos and he said I'm a weird guy I don't really like people doing my stuff like I I like to spend the time in the lab get in and learn my own stuff and I'm like yeah I can dig that but what I do is I be watching Styles and when he do shit I try to steal it <laughs> so anyway I like running with Styles because I high key be stealing all this man moves and then I try to add my own little flair to it but I'm still I'm still green you know I'm still a noob with it 19 to 11. Let's get him up out of here. We've had enough fun. Played around. Let him hang around. It's time to get out of here. I don't know if I had enough flash in this game. I still ain't dropped the post score, did I? Hold up. I might have to try to drop him on this last play. Hold up. Five seconds on the shot clock. They got to throw up something. That's not going to work. We got the board. We're pushing the tempo. Uh-oh. Hold up. Philly want to stop and go ISO. Get him, Philly. All three defenders crash. Rain. That's your game. Get up out of here, man. Anyway. I wanted to drop the post score, but I didn't. 
I mean, I tried my best. It didn't work. I'm going to go a little bit harder for y'all in the next video. I want to keep it. I want to try to keep it short. So that's all I got. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, drop that like. If you new, hit subscribe. I'm out the next time, y'all. Peace. We'll be doing all that.